the reason why art works is because nobody knows totally why it works. Otherwise, even good artists would only make good work, and that's just not the case. There is only very few things that are really special, and what coincides to make things this way, nobody totally really understands. You can talk about something from a distance over time, why something might be better than the other. In the moment of creation, you don't know. So I have a little education and I'm in a lot of fields just self-taught. You can support certain interests and you can connect people with other people that have similar interests through schools, but I don't think you can actually teach it. You can teach how you edit yourself, but you gotta be very careful because you can edit too much too quick. You know, you can use any part of your existence to make art with. You can use any part of your body, you can use your brain, your culture, you can use somebody else's culture, you can use anything you want to make art. It's not restricted. Right here, we all have a little guy, and the little guy knows exactly the answer to anything. That's the guy you should listen to, because he always knows. What other people tell you what to do, listen to this guy if you should ignore it, you know. Ors Fisher is our first artist that we're working with at a hospital, which is really, really exciting because what FIGS does, right, we make medical apparel for the healthcare professional. Our goal at FIGS is to bring scrubs to the 21st century, right, through design, technology, innovation. That's my job day to day. Diane Brown from RX Art introduced Ors Fisher and myself. That's how we kind of started this collaboration called the PJ Project. Actually, it's never involved an artist before, Yes, we make uniforms. Yes, we make apparel for adults so they can perform better. But this is for children. So they could actually wake up every single day and imagine something better. I wouldn't do anything other than this. This is, I mean, I'm, I feel very lucky to be doing this. We as humans, we need to take care of our children. And, and I think if we can help that, we should help that. In a way, to put it on the body makes the most sense. It's like a little happy armor, you know. You see, I have been in children's hospital with children that were not doing well, and when you actually in there, day in, day out, it gets very real. And you see children in there, they got stuck in there for months, their whole families basically camp out next to a bed, and anything you can do helps. And the parents also take a lot of strain if your child is, is ill if they feel it's a place that cares a bit. It just elevates the entire package you need for somebody to heal, from the kid itself to the hospital to the family. It just it, it elevates the situation, you know. To change these uniforms you're given as a patient in a hospital when you're a kid, to kind of not feel marked, but to feel like you put on something that's actually cool, I think it's a brilliant idea you guys had. I agree. Well, so the normal patient gown, they showed you're behind. And when you're a kid, especially if you're a kid and you're not feeling your best, you don't want to show that. You want something to make you feel cool and alive. And that's what these patient gowns do. And in terms of our design, it's designed very differently. The actual silhouette, we have hoods, we have pants, and you can still have access points to get in, you know, to, to help the kids. We all have this memory of the one cool t-shirt we have and we're five or something we thought like, well, that's really cool and it's different. And you kind of put it on and you feel like invincible. That's the goal, I will fail. But like, it's this idea that something can give you this kind of energy. This and shield, this superpower. What, exactly, and what that is, I mean, that's different for everybody. So we're very excited about this. We're very excited about you know, working with Ors. CHLA is going to love this. Actually, I'm, I'm a little envious. I want some myself, my size, you know. <laughs> they, were, they feel very good, you know. It's, not, it's, it's kind of like a cool thing to have. Feel somebody cared. <laughs>